Hey guys, it's Sharon and welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button down below to join the family. It is literally six in the morning right now. I was just watching Kelsey Loves Pho mukbangs and she was eating spicy noodles and it honestly made me crave spicy noodles so bad. I really do want to try the way she makes it. I'm gonna do that another day because I don't have those ingredients. When I go to the Asian market, I'm gonna get the ingredient to try it her way. But for today, I just got the spicy noodles at the bottom with Spam sunny side up eggs. And then I forgot to put the mozzarella cheese when I was doing all the toppings, but I added it after at the bottom right here. I don't know if you guys can see, but I added it at the bottom. Put some scallions on the top. Craving this so, so bad. And I also have some cucumbers and I also have some lettuce as well. So let's go ahead and take a bite. But you guys, I literally could not sleep. I've been having a really hard time sleeping lately. Let me take a bite first before we talk about it. Here's what it's looking like. Make sure you get everything in your bite. Bon appetitis. That is bomb. I never add the whole packet. I literally add like less than half because it, it be so spicy. And my dog is sitting right here because he wants a cucumber. Here. Take it over there to your bed. But yeah, you guys, I've been having a really hard time sleeping lately and I've been getting a lot of body pains because you guys, I sleep with my arms up like this. I don't know what it is. Literally, like I, I have to sleep like this or I can't sleep. I even tried sleeping with like on top of my hands, but then my hands would just fall asleep. So that didn't work. I even tried like laying on my like on my side and then putting my hands like under my legs, like to hold it, and I would still wake up in this. This position and literally I would wake up and like my whole body would be sore because my arms are up like this and honestly I haven't been sleeping good lately because of my pains are like going through the day now guys if you have any tips or anything um literally my whole life I've been sleeping like this but it's starting to something that's affecting me now and I feel like I can't sleep unless my arms are up and I don't know why that is. It's not even that I'm not falling asleep. Like, it's just hurting. And I feel like when my arms are up, that's my most comfortable state to sleep in. And I don't know what why that is. So, y'all, I need some help. 
I looked it up as well, you guys. Like, why like why do people sleep with their arms up? And it says, like, a breathe way, like an airway. You can breathe better. But I don't know what it is. Like, I sleep with my windows open already for, like, cold air because I, I get really stuffy at night. Like, so I sleep with the windows open because I just need that fresh air. So they, I did see an article that was, like, um, people do that because they, they can't breathe too good in their sleep. I also even try like sleeping on my belly and then I would wake up still with my arms up but facing down. Literally you guys, it just doesn't fail. I just don't know what to do anymore. Like I would literally wake up and cannot feel my arms. Like that's how they, they don't fell asleep and everything. I mean, I'm sleeping really good at night though. Like I'm not having problems sleeping at night. It's just when I wake up, that's when you start feeling all the pains and stuff. But lately, well not lately, but since since yesterday the pain just didn't go away and I just couldn't fall asleep because I'm feeling the pain It's about to be seven o'clock. The sun better come out, and I'm over here eating spicy noodles. And I got a gym later, so hopefully this is not affecting me. Hopefully it'll come out before I did take my immunity shot. So hopefully it'll flush out. But y'all know what? I'm gonna try it with this lettuce. Put a little bit of noodles. Then we gonna add our spam. I use the less sodium spam because the regular one's just too salty. And then I just cook this and then I just glazed it with gluten-free teriyaki sauce. I'm put some egg, fold it over. Cheers. That's good, y'all. <laughs> y'all, I just did my nails. I know in my morning vlog, I said I was gonna do nails with you guys, a Valentine's set. But I had filmed that video and the nails came out horrendous, okay? They looked it so bad and I soaked them off so quickly. Like, it was just... No, it was a no for me. I did do a new set, but I didn't record myself doing this one. And then this one actually came out super, super cute. I'm still a beginner, so I just think my nails came out really, really cute for it to be like a beginner. I'm still going to do that video, but it's just going to take some time. Maybe in about a week or so, you guys will see that video when I decide to um, change my nails. Because I just did these on Saturday. Today's Thursday, so it hasn't even been a full week. Every time I eat spicy food, my nose just be running. Literally, not be sliding down my nose. I feel like I don't have much to do. I just have a lot of editing to do. I have to edit a few YouTube shorts. I have to edit a few videos for my coloring page. 
So if you guys aren't following my coloring page on Instagram, I will link it down below. Make sure you guys go follow. If you're into like ASMR satisfying noises, that's what this pretty much is. do post the videos also here on my YouTube shorts. It's the same videos on my Instagram. So it really, it doesn't really matter where you watch it. You know what somebody commented the other day on my YouTube short? Can you show your face for real? Girl, if you clicked on the channel, you would have seen I make videos, baby. I just looked at her comment like, and we don't take the negativity. Remove your comment and you're done. Bye. Like she literally commented on the YouTube short. Can you show your face for real? So you took the time out to press on the comment, type your comment, post your comment, but you didn't have time to just click on the name and you would have saw like it, it's literally a face to all of that. Like girl, I'm like that was so unnecessary. I'm getting full, y'all. Oh shit, my phone been on Do Not Disturb. My phone goes on Do Not Disturb at 12 a.m. every day, and I be forgetting. I be forgetting to like turn it back off when I wake up and stuff, and I be going through the day and without turning it off. Oh my god. I think I'm pretty much done eating. It's a little bit left, but it's pretty spicy, and I never can eat the whole thing. So most likely, I will eat this later. Uh, I just throw it in the microwave, add a little bit more cheese, and then we can eat it again. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. It really was just like a sit-down chat and eat with me, really, though. Because, you know, just feel like we need to hang out more. Like, come on. Thank you for watching today's video. Make sure you guys give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below to join the family. And I'll see you guys in the next video.